So we are going to be um, going through an elemental an elementalization, also a hydration ceremony where we'll bathe the Shiva Lingam. So if you can get into a state of receptivity, if you do have some vibhuti, you can apply it across your forehead and you can say Om Namah Shivaya and then you can take some kum kum, the red powder and put it on your uh, spot between your two eyebrows and say Om Kaleem and then you are ready to connect to the divine, to connect to these rituals connect to Dr. Ply. So what we have in front of us is an altar or a table that has some various items. And the items represent the nine, or sorry, the five elements. The five elements are earth, water, fire, air, and space. And they are uh, represented by the offerings. So the offerings, that we are going to do are represented here. So we have some food that is represents earth. So earth element and the sound na. And then we have water that we are going to offer. The water, of course, represents uh, something that we can drink or give the divine to drink. And then that is going to be cleansing internally and it re is represented by the second chakra. So earth is the first chakra, the muladhara at the base of the spine. Then the navel and the abdomen is filled with water. And then the next element is going to be represented by this ghee lamp, this light. You can see inside there's a cotton wick and then there is ghee or clarified butter. And the gods love this, especially Lord Shiva and also the goddess Lakshmi. <laughs> So prosperity and enlightenment is represented by this ghee lamp. And that will help to activate the fire element within us at the heart center, down the arms and in the hands. And then also to activate the heart chakra. So the other element, the next one is going to be the element air. Once I light this incense stick that is a planetary incense stick uh, for, for the planet Sun, because today is Sunday here in Eastern Standard Time in Toronto, Canada, where I am. So we will uh, get into that uh, state of receptivity, connecting with the air element in the throat, the mouth, and into the uh, nostrils as well. Then the Akash or ether element is represented, the space element is represented by flowers. Now, why flowers? Well, flowers are like uh, the ancient text message. So this is what the, um, who, whoever prayed with flowers, they used this technology to go to the divine. And it makes sense because even when someone gives you flowers, you're just so delighted, you're so happy, you're so blissed, and you're so thankful and grateful. So the divine loves the flowers just like you love flowers if someone gives them to you or you buy them for yourself, or you have them around. And when you offer them, you really love them because you know that the prayers that you infuse, the sound uh, for the flowers is ya. So uh, back up a bit. So we had na is the sound for food. First chakra at the base of the spine and in the legs. Ma is the sound for water. That's the second chakra, the belly button, the navel center, the whole abdomen, fill it with water. The third sound is the sound she, and that represents fire in the heart center, the heart chakra, down the arms and hands, set them on fire. And then on uh, the once we light this, you'll see the smoke that represents the air element. And that is rep represented by the sound va, and that is going to be activating the throat the mouth and the nostrils purifying it. And then again, one more time, the akash, ether, the space energy is represented by the flower petal offerings, the sound ya. So, and that is in the two eyes and the two brains, the third eye. So now that we've got all that intellectual food for thought, let's get into soul food. So how we're going to do that now is connect with the soul or the beings that are represented. 
And I'm so happy because we have 108 Shiva Lingams. And uh, then we have also here uh, on, in this red, you can see this red velvet or silk um, embedded uh, case with uh, 27 Shiva Lingams that represent the birth stars. If you know your star, if you know your birth star and nakshatra, you can feel that energy being transmitted from the elementalization that we will do. We're going to be offering some bilva leaves as well. These bilva leaves are the leaves of Shiva. They, Shiva loves them. So we are blessed to be able to have them here uh, and they're nice and fresh. So they look like this. They usually come in three. I have 108. So we're going to do 108 Om Namah Shivaya offerings with this bilva. And this is the spiritual science, the high tech, where you may think we're just offering this, but this is going to bring Shiva consciousness to these sacred objects. And these sacred objects are going to then transmit the energy to you. Thank you.